All right, guys, get ready for segment four. I hope you got lots of practice with the segment three. You're still training on segment two and segment one. This is how segment four goes. I'm gonna take a couple steps over. I ended segment three with the uppercut. Next thing I do, snap. You're gonna keep moving on that 45 degree line. The only difference is you're moving backwards, okay? So first thing, step back to an X stance and you're gonna do your low strike. Step back to a back stance, low strike. Step back to an X stance, low strike. Now you're gonna go low, middle, high. So another low strike, that makes four. Middle, high. Prepare, drop down. This is gonna be a low strike. Low, low, ready, thrust. We're gonna end segment four right there on that technique. So let's break it down. First thing we're gonna do, no footwork. From right here, what I did was I had my uppercut and I shifted. So the first set position, our start position, is going to be left foot in the front. Just start with your feet together, and we wanna really create a good core, uh, stability, so as I'm doing my techniques, I don't wanna wiggle all around. So we're gonna start, one, two, three. One, two, three. Prepare, drop. One, two, punch, thrust. Hope that was fast enough for you. Let's do it again. Follow me. One, low. Two, low. Three, low. Low, middle, high. Prepare, drop it. One, two, ready, thrust. Okay, that's how it goes. So, I'm gonna do the combo facing the camera and moving backwards. Let's break it down even more. So start in your sparring stance. Remember from segment three, I always said to stomp your foot. This is a good way to get that timing. So when I hit my lat muscle, hopefully you're doing that from the segment three video, you're hitting your lat muscle and you're hitting the pad of your shoulder instead of that bone. We're gonna start from here, stomp your foot and hit your muscle at the same time. So it's gonna go one, then you're gonna do go two, then you're gonna step back, three, then you're gonna go four, now you're gonna hit your lat muscle, punch out with the right arm. Don't go too high. Because the bow staff is angled, when I go down an inch with my hand, it's gonna go down six inches with the bow staff. So you gotta watch where the tip is pointed. From right here, I'm gonna be in the middle, high strike. Then right here, imagine that you hit him in the head and you wanna push him down to the ground. So from right here, prepare, drop it, make that a strike, boom. One, two, three, Four. Okay, everybody, one more thing. Here's your secret ninja trick. When you're doing this part of the form, you're doing a lot of low strikes. But think about when you're sparring. If I'm always looking at your feet, you know where I'm going to hit. If I'm looking at your head, you've always seen someone in sparring, they go, and then they go for your head, and you see it coming, and you get that good block. Same thing when you're doing weapons. Focus on the center of the chest. Hyper. Focus on the center. So when you start here, this is how it should look. As you step back, your eyes stay in the same spot. Watch my eyes. One, two, three. One, two, three. Right here, their head's here, but you're gonna push their whole body down to the ground. So I want you to focus instead of, you know, 10 feet out, or like I tell my students, focus on the judge's hair. Instead of doing that, focus on the tip of the bow staff. Now as you go down, boom, you follow it. Now you're gonna finish the person off right there. Punch up as high as you can. I see it all the time, <clears throat> like this. They have the power, but they don't have the length. And that, that's what makes the martial arts artistic. That big, long strike. Boom, you keep your eyes focused right there. So we wanna make sure throughout this segment, your eyes are focused on the center of your imaginary opponent's chest until you get to that push. Drop your head. And that's what's cool about it, is that change of focus. Anytime you're snapping your head up and down, that's really gonna make it outstanding. All right, good luck with this segment and watch the next video. Next segment is gonna be even more exciting.